All right, folks. You can see I started painting the hutch on my uh, music desk. Now, one of the paints I'm using, or the paint, oh, sorry about that. Camera got stuck on my shoelace, the tripod. Is this um, Minwax Poly Shades Polyurethane. And um, the thing about this polyurethane, or any polyurethane, is you can never shake this. You don't want to get shake it because you'll get bubbles in the whole thing. So, what I'm doing is I'm painting with a paintbrush, but I got a chopstick here and I stirred it up with that carefully as not to introduce bubbles and air into the uh, into the mix. All right, so I'm painting away with my paintbrush, and we'll be back. All right, so there's the top, the hutch. I'm not the best with a paintbrush, but not so bad. A couple of little drips here and there, but it's about that. The best part of this whole thing is watching a mosquito go to its death as it like lands on the freaking thing. Pretty cool. Alright, so I'm going to start on the tabletop now. All right, so the desk is uh, painted. I have it up on a couple of uh, couple of horses. I painted the shelf underneath. It's the other side. And I put the hutch over here to dry. This is the back side of it. Put another coat of paint on the top. That's drying now. I'm going to let that sit and dry. All right, here we are, three coats in. And I have to tell you, this Minwax Poly Shades is amazing. I did, I bought three of those. I only used one. And I have like three coats on the table. Two coats on the shelf and three coats on the hutch. Get an idea what it looks like. You know, I'm not the most perfect painter in the world. There's a few drips here and there. But I got probably about three good coats on the top. Of that polyurethane, it's tinted black. So I'm gonna let that dry, and I'm done. All I gotta do is assemble it and uh, screw in the uh, rails for the rack mount. Looks pretty good. All right. Hey guys. I just wanted to show you, I screwed in the um, rack rails. I'll put a link for these rails on the bottom of this video. And uh, basically the height of this I made based on the length of these, which is uh, ten and a half inches. Um, I gave a little extra room on the top and bottom. Uh, just so this wouldn't be scraping on the bottom, but I got a six space rail um, They sell them in three space and, and other Sizes, you know, and um, 
I decided to make this to fit a six space rail. So I'll put the link for those on the bottom. And I also screwed in the rails for the shelf on the bottom. Alright, so basically from here I'm just going to need to put this together in the music studio. I want to show you what I'm going to do. I'm going to secure the top to the desk using these um, pieces of metal. And basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to take those and screw the top to the bottom along the back edge. So I'm going to put part of it here and part of it going across the bottom. Screw it in, screw it in, and I'll be done attaching the top to the bottom. But I'm going to do that after I get this into the music studio. All right, so I got the bottom two corners screwed in. I'm going to be ready to put this thing back together. All right, guys. So you're starting to get an idea of what this is looking like. I have, uh, you know, my uh, racks I'm starting to screw in. And I have uh, the top shelf has my monitors and my uh, screens and I have my stereo power amp my shelf underneath I can pull out my uh, keyboard and uh, what I'm doing is I'm using this keyboard as a MIDI controller And I'm using a soft plug in. I don't know if you can see this, the key going down as I hit it. And that's what it's looking like so far. And as you can see, I got plenty of room to expand. I have some other racks that I'm going to be start screwing in on the side as I uh, get this ready to go. I'm just starting to plug everything back in. All right, so that's what it's looking like. Recording studio desk. And that's where I'm at. Hope you enjoyed watching this. And, um, you know. You see what's great about it is I'm able to have more room in this room because everything is stacked. I think that's pretty neat. You know, have a shorter desk in the front. It gives me more room in the room and I have the shelf for the keyboard. On the bottom, come in and out. Alright, thanks for watching.